and welcome. My name is Heroin Bob and welcome to Bob Buys. For this video, we are going to do a Stitch Fix unboxing and Moxie is going to be adorable and want all of the attention because that's what she does because she's my baby. So those of you that don't know, Stitch Fix is a fashion subscription box where they send you five pieces of clothing based on a quiz that you take when you initially sign up as well as notes and sometimes your Instagram profile when your stylist decides to, you know, get a little more attentive. Um, and they send you five clothes that they think that you're going to like. They also do accessories, bags, handbags, purses, um, and they do uh, jewelry, earrings, bracelets. They also do shoes. Uh, I, however, don't really wear jewelry. I don't I have my Fitbit, but I don't really wear jewelry. Um, I lead a very active lifestyle, so it just, I don't like things tugging on my bits. Uh, also, uh, I don't really want shoes because I have enough of those <laughs> and I don't really need any more. <laughs> So, however, I do have a hard time finding clothes, which is why when you guys see me go out thrifting for resale, sometimes things don't make it onto the websites that I sell on. Sometimes they go directly into my closet because when I find something that fits, I honestly don't care what it costs. I want it in my life and on my body, which is what happened with this. I bought this for resale and then it fits gorgeously and it's made out of this soft, comfy, like, jersey cotton and it's not going nowhere. So. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> so let's go ahead and open this box up and see what I got this month. <laughs> so this is the box. It is a little tiny box because again, I don't uh, get accessories and it's also not winter yet. They do do coats and stuff as well. So be mindful of that. Uh, the shipping to you is free. It does cost a $20 for a styling fee, which will actually go towards any items that you decide that you want to keep in the box. I have a baby burrito. Oh my goodness. This is the babiest of burritos I have ever seen. Look at this baby burrito. Oh, there's the return bag. Hello, return bag. Goodbye, return bag. So I know I've talked about this in another video, which I will link up above. My hand is exactly eight inches long. It is eight inches by nine inches. This is the babiest of burritos. So uh, I guess let's look at my styling note from my stylist and I did request Catherine again so let's see what she has to say that is the wrong thing let's see what she has to say <laughs> whoopsie hey there welcome to your fourth fix I hope you're having a fabulous week and looking forward to another fix no problem I'm here to listen and do my best to get you pieces you'll love and feel comfortable no capris ever got it that was a big thing from last time. I did want to send that full length adjustable hem buttons on the inside 20, 20, 30. So potentially this could be the perfect fit for you. Let me know if you love me forever or not. You can dress the pants down with the Lila J Dolman sleeve or wear this around the house for errands. Sticking to those lighter fabrics and summery pieces, I wasn't able to add those deep colors, but I am on the lookout. You can pair the Lila Lee button down with the scallop shirt and give your legs breather or pair with your shorts. I hope you enjoy. Okay. Let's look at my tiny burrito. I've never seen a burrito this small. Um, okay. I see pink. Do you see a lot of pink? No. <laughs> but this does feel, oh, this is actually, even though this is pink, it is gray. Gray is my other favorite color and it is cute. So I guess this is the domain. It is a small. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys everything I get and then I will do a try on at the end. This is, that's kind of cute. This actually kind of screams Mary from the black vintage to me. This looks like something she wear because it's, you know, button up. <laughs> oh, this is black. You guys, I like black. This is cute. Uh, it has this really cute, like, lace detail on the back, but this feels like plastic. Moxie, can you not? She like keeps rubbing her nose on my elbow and it's like leaving little snot trails on her. On, yeah, this is plastic. If you guys wonder why, why I keep saying this is plastic, um, the natural fibers are linen, cotton, wool, and silk. 
Um, there is also modal fabrics made out of beech wood, which can be considered natural. There's also flax as well. Flax is normally a linen material. If it is not made from those materials, it is plastic. It is made out of plastic. Uh, it's made out of oil, plastic oils. You got rayon, you got spandex. There was just questions the last couple times and that's just so you know. So this is plastic. I actually didn't check the other thing to see what it was. This is soft, but this is a domain. This is the domain. So the domain is when it's like, doesn't really have a set sleeve. It's just kind of like a floppy bat, which is super fun to wear. Let me tell you what, but I think this is also plastic. Also plastic, but it's gray. I like gray. So maybe. This, has, this is Skies Are Blue. I'm sure I didn't tell you what the other ones were. This is a black skirt. This is a cute skirt. It's got an adjustable waist at the back. Does it have pockets? It has pockets. It actually has scallop pockets. I don't know if you guys can see that. But, oh, oh it has a scalloped hem too. That's kind of cute. And we have pants. We have gray plaid pants. We have a gray plaid pants in a size six. Multi-directional stretch. So this will have some, I don't mind a blend either. Cotton, viscose, and spandex. So thank you for at least finding something with some fabric content in it. All right, I guess let's, uh, let's try this on and see what happens, shall we? Can you see the problem? Is the problem obvious to you? This is, this is, first of all, the pants are not comfy. <laughs> they are the right length though. So kudos Catherine for giving me the right length pants. They just, they don't, the rise isn't right. It just don't feel good. And it makes me feel kind of fat and I'm not fat. It just makes me feel squishy up here. I don't like it. Um, it's just, it's not, it's not like the fun flappy doll main sleeves. It's just kind of like this does not fit well. This is a medium. Uh, I'm a medium if it's got, or like I'm normally a medium or large if it's got long sleeves because I have muscles. This is just, this is a, this is a no. This is all the way a no. Okay, um, small problem. I love this. <laughs> And it's all plastic. <laughs> so I'm not sure how my skin will like being in this. Uh, I do have very sensitive skin. I, I am immunocompromised, unfortunately. Part of my uh, neurological disorder is that uh, my autonomic system doesn't regulate itself. So sometimes I'll just have random allergic reactions. And that is, um, that is exacerbated by wearing plastic clothes. So I, don't like the color pink. I love this shirt. This is, I feel cute in this outfit. This skirt is cute. The skirt fits nice. I like it. It's comfy. It has pockets. It hits me like right where I would want a business skirt to be. This is cute. I am tempted. Let me try on the big fluffy bat shirt. Okay. So domain, or domain shirts, bat wings, right? Totally cool. The problem is they sent me medium and uh, domains are normally already oversized. So I could totally wear this as a dress because it is way too big. <laughs> what the actual heck? Like, I have some of them called bat sleeves. I love, I, I love domains mostly because they just are fun to wear. Cause I'll end up doing this all day and look ridiculous. But this is obviously a no. But I seriously need to think about that button down or the button up. And I really like this skirt <laughs> a lot. Uh, I guess let's go see how much they cost. So for the oversized domain dress cost $50. That's a no, so don't have to worry about that. The button down top that I liked is only $38. So 
And the skirt I really like, this geyser blue skirt, is $48. The other two things, uh, the pants are $88. Again, if they fit, the inseam is perfect. The, the up here fit, not good. And that black oversized thing was $64. So the two things I liked are the two cheapest things and I think I'm gonna get them. <laughs> I like am really surprised again I really don't like pink like I it looks good on me because of my skin because I'm a pasty lady Moxie apparently likes it too and I really like that skirt a lot I think I'm gonna get them guys so if you see me wearing them in upcoming video videos you know uh, I did actually pull the trigger on it but thank you guys so much for watching I know this is not you know bargains that I can flip for profit this is actually like full retail clothes but clothes are hard sometimes and that's why like people like buying lower cost things on Mercari and Poshmark and eBay it's because of the fact that they don't have to go to the thrift store to find it but then they can find something for a better deal online and we really just want clothes that make us feel good so thank you guys so much for watching uh, I will put a code down below if you guys want to try stitch picks out for yourself you'll get your first styling fee for free and um, that credit again will go towards the purchase of your items and uh, I'll see you guys next video bye you ruined it cat hero. bye hero 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 I wanna be a hero hero Who do you